Hey guys, and welcome to episode one of Seven Days to Die, Die Day Friday. Um, the reason that I call it, I'm going to call it Die Day Friday, is because I'm going to put out one video um, every Friday and see how it does. Now, um, there's a couple things to note. One, this game is an alpha, right? So there are going to be bugs. There are going to be things that they're going to improve. Um, and, you know, it it's one of those things, it's, it's only going to get better. Now, you do have to buy it, uh, buy into the alpha if you want. And I'll put the, the links for their page in the description. Um, as you can see right here, I am a female character. I don't know if you can change that. Um, it's probably something that's being planned for the future. Um, now, this game is sort of like a Minecraft meets DayZ. Um, it's a voxel-based game, and you can uh, pick up things in the world and um, and interact with just about everything in craft. And, um, now, it's daytime, so I'm relatively safe, even with the zombies this close. Right? Um, I'm going to go back to first person. Um, even with the zombies this close, because during the day, they uh, they don't run very fast, right? But as you can see in the top left, it's, you know, the time's ticking away. So I'm going to want, just like uh, Minecraft, let's go ahead and search a few things. Um, and I'm still getting used to control. But just like Minecraft, we have to try to survive our first night, right? And um, so I'm going to have to find some kind of shelter. Now these guys, the difference in this game is... Um, they will break down walls. Uh, the zombies will basically um, they're they're break down anything that they can find, or that yeah, basically to get to you. Um, let me see. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab up a little bit of this stuff. Now this is a barrel. Um, they do explode. But in this case, I want to put it down so I can get on top of here. Come on. Is it not gonna let me it's not gonna let me put it down right next to it? Okay. That's what I wanted. Or was it whatever is in the sports bag there. And trash cans are okay, but generally I don't really go through trash cans um, as much. Backpacks, on the other hand, backpacks normally have a whole bunch of good stuff. Now, um, one thing you do have to keep in mind in this game is you do have food and water. So it's like, like I said, it's like Daisy. Um, now, if we go inside here, you can see there the zombies are breaking, uh, trying to break stuff to get out. Even though they have a way out right there. And. Um, this is one of those you want to be very careful because indoors, where it's shaded, it's the light that really... It's just like Minecraft. This, it's the, the sun that kills the zombies. Let me adjust my sound here real quick. Okay. Um, one bad thing about the game is because it is an alpha... Oops. Because it is an alpha, it's, um, it, they're still working out some things. Um, sound is one thing that, uh, that I have noticed there's, there's sometimes an issue with. Oh, shit! I don't have any weapons. And there's a zombie up here. But up here we're in the daylight, so I don't have to worry about them sneaking up on me like that. And um, and I I do just want to put it out there right now. Uh, this this game most likely is not going to be a PG rated videos. Um, I will slip up. I know that uh, Minecraft is a lot easier. Uh, it's just the style of gameplay. Cooking pot. 
So let's go ahead and let's um, collect up a whole bunch of stuff and see what we can do now. Um, the goal is survive the first night, basically. And there's already zombies up on that roof. But if I look at my map, there's another small building over here. So let me, what I'm going to do, and I do have a little bit of time, because you can see it's only one in the afternoon. Um, one nice thing about this game is they do uh, at least give you the time. So you can, you can know when night's coming and you really need to get out, uh, get indoors. So let me, I believe it was up this way, up the road. So I'm going to go up the road here, just grabbing whatever bags and stuff I can find on the way. Actually, I do need some wood. And this is um, the only source of wood out in the desert, is these little stumps. And uh, they're actually called aged wood. That's, that's just it. Um, car trunks are really good to search because you can find stuff like that. So now I have a gun and a gas cap. Um, and I didn't put that on the right bar, did I? Nope, it needs to go down here. It's unlike Minecraft, this is, it's, it's not three slots, it's four. And so I got a little bit of ammo. I'm going to leave the spike traps down there. Yeah, see, I just got different kinds of aged wood. Oil barrel. Okay. Now, you only have so much ammo, and it only does so much damage um, to zombies. So, it's kind of one of those you, you really want to conserve it and use it only when you need to. Until you have, uh, you know, a good supply of it. There it is. There's that little house. And you can see in the in the left side, my stamina is going down. It's the blue bar, right? Um, so that's one thing you really want to keep in mind at night. Because, um... Ooh, small trash bin. Ah. I saw it. He just walked right up on me. And... I was pushing the wrong button. So, the health is the little, um... Ooh. The health is the little red, right, with the, the heart. That's your health. Um, I believe it slowly regenerates. Um, not 100% sure. Still trying to get used to the controls here, but I do want to put the shotgun. And the reason that I'm putting the ammo on here, on the bar too, is because um, it needs to be on the bar to reload. And I don't really want to shoot them, because I don't want to use up ammo. I just wanted to lead them away from this. And yeah, this does not look like it's going to be a, a good spot for the night. So we're going to continue moving. And let's go check out this building here. After I get this backpack. Um, backpacks are one of those things that you want to keep your eye out for. Um, they generally have uh, you know, good things in them. And so I wanted to go this direction. And now I have. Oops. Okay, it's about three in the afternoon. So far, I'm only collecting things. I'll, I'll show you the crafting system when we, um, you know, find a, a good place to, to stay for the night. And you can see right there, I ran out of stamina. Right, I was just running too much, and then you you're forced to walk, and that can be dangerous. That can be very very dangerous if um, if it's at night or if you you know if it's 
getting night and you have a zombie chasing you, uh, you got to be really, really careful on uh, on your stamina. Oh, don't tell me that's what was on the map. Okay, no, it's right past it. Speed limit 45. Now, as far as I know, um, because it's still now for, like I said, they're still implementing things. As far as I know, there is no usable cars. Now, I think that's something that they plan to do in the future. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. There it goes. Some stuff will collapse um, when you run on it. And I didn't want all that to happen because I can probably salvage some of it. Now, just like Minecraft... Ooh, this is already boarded up. I bet you there's some inside, though. Hmm, this might be a good place. We can go ahead and wall this off here. Oh, there's barbed wire there. Take care of this guy. No, I don't want to. And see, the spike traps will kill them. Where are they? I hear them. Okay, so we're, we're getting close tonight. Let's see if there's a, a way up onto the roof. It looks, it looks fairly well guarded. There's zombies up on the roof. You see, I'm not ready to engage them just yet. I want a way up. Uh oh, it's starting to get night. This is not good. Um. Why, why can't I shoot you? Oh. Okay, now one thing to keep in mind is that when you die, you only lose what's in your hotbar. Okay, now this is bad because if you look at the time of the day, right, but if I check, I only lose what's in my hotbar. So I still have a pistol, um, but I want to get back there and quickly. Um, wow, I'm way back here and that's, okay, let's... This is going to be risky. I don't know if I'm going to make it. No. Again, I did not put this in my hotbar. Um, but you see all the items in my inventory um, I was able to, to keep. Now, I did get an auger, which is really nice. Um, augers basically can be used on just about any material. Um, as far as I know, you can, you can break just about any material with them. Okay, well, I'm gaining up stamina. Yeah, I see it's, it's over this way. Ooh, six o'clock in the evening. And it's done in military time. Um, I don't know if that's an option. I don't I don't think it is. But um you know, it'd be cool if they had an option for AM PM. Now, I'm an army veteran, so military time doesn't bother me, but um, but I know some people have a hard time reading it. To me it's actually easier. Okay, so let's, while we're running there, let's see. Hmm, I don't have a lot. Let's do some crafting real quick. Right, what I want is I want some old wood. And I can take aged wood and make old wood. And then you can see, once you learn the recipe, you can just click on it. And it'll put whatever's in your, your inventory to make it. 
Right, now this, it'll show only what you can make. Um, I need to keep moving. It'll show only what you can make with the items that you currently have. Okay, now it doesn't tell you how to make them. Uh, so it's, you know, it's sort of like Minecraft, X, where you can, you know, make quite a few different things. But, um, but it doesn't show you, uh, it doesn't show you how. What? Minecraft doesn't either, so, um, and one other thing is, yeah, see, it's getting nighttime. I don't want to go in here with a pistol if there's tons of zombies. And see, I just, um, alerted them. You know what? Come on, explode! Oh, it's not exploding. Now it explodes. Go figure. Um, you don't want to try to get cars with, um, you know, melee because they do explode. Okay, I need to get inside right now and I need to ah, a ladder yes zombies can't climb ladders that doesn't mean that they can't spawn up here right um, and I, I'm not 100% sure on the spawning mechanics it, sometimes it seems like they don't spawn when, when you're when you're around. Sometimes it seems like they don't spawn when there's light. Um, I I really don't don't know 100% these spawning mechanics. Something I will be trying to figure out. Okay, so it looks like we're coming down to our our first night. So it's coming to a close. Now, real quick, I'm going to show you just a little bit of crafting. We're going to take the old wood that we have, we're going to make old plywood, right? And it'll show you how many items you need, so it's just one. So now we know how to make that, okay? So now we have old plywood, so now we want to make sticks. And again, it shows you that I need one item, and it's old plywood. I just know that. So now we have sticks. Put those down, now we can make a couple of things. First thing I want to make, torches. So I have sticks. Now I know I need something else, right? Normally you'd look it up on the wiki or something like that, but I know it's cloth, right? So let's go ahead and take those. And now, just like before, um, I know if I put this back in my inventory, I know I can make torches just by clicking on it. So that's all, that's all my sticks. They should start being really fast here any moment. And just like Minecraft, you can place stuff down. Um, again, I don't know if it's the light that keeps the zombies away, or if it's just that I'm here. Because I have had it to where when I go and log off, zombies spawn even where I have lit up. So, um, whether or not the light stops them, I don't know, but it definitely helps uh, me, you know, because zombies will chase you down in the dark, and they can see a whole lot better than I can. Okay, so that should stay lit up. Um, not sure about the lighting thing. One other thing is the sound, right? The sound in this game, um, a lot of times it seems like it's not very directional. Uh, or, or also the uh, the volume a lot of times is um, is a little misleading. You can't you can't tell if something's far away or close. Yeah, see what happens at night? They get really strong and they get really fast. You do not want to be outside at night. The only thing that's saving me here is this ladder. 
Oh, holy cow. They must they now see zombies will just destroy stuff. Um, just I mean they're they're dead, right? So they're they're just destroying stuff mindlessly. And uh, some stuff explodes when you destroy it, like cars, uh, the burning barrels, or oil bell barrels, stuff like that. So it's nighttime. It's our first night. Will we survive? It's anybody's guess. Um, with that, I will see you guys next Friday for another Die Day Friday. Uh, hope this building does not come down around us. And with that, I will see you guys later. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, everyone counts. And uh, feel free to leave any comments on any of the videos. I do try to read them all. And, um, and if I can, respond. And with that, I will see you guys later.